wrong? Not feeling well today. Tired, sleepy. Miss your grandma. I can't believe it's been a year since she passed. I know. I miss her too, but it's okay, Papa. I'll take care of you. I know you will. You had to grow up so fast this year, but I'm glad you're here with me. I just wish you had gotten to know your mom and your dad before they passed. I'm so sorry, sweetie. That's okay, Papa. Is she seeing me now? I just wish you could see you and how much you've grown this past year. Papa, do you think Grandma knows we are thinking about her? I don't know. I hope so. Just remember what you promised me. I remember. You never let me forget. Why don't you get washed up for dinner? I'm not feeling very well. That's okay, Papa. I'll get our dinner. I feel very well today. Tired, sleepy. Miss your grandmother so much. I can't believe it's been a year since she died. Papa, you said that already. Now you're scaring me. I did really well in my spelling and math today. And that new boy still bothered me. I almost got in trouble. Papa? 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 Please wake up, please! No! No! Please don't leave me. I'm really sorry, Emma. That's okay. <laughs> Emma, I'm so sorry for your loss. Your grandfather was a good man, and he was my good friend. Come, it's time to go. Hey. Hey, you all right? Yeah, I guess. It just seems really strange that he's gone. Well, I have to go. Then read me the will, where that is. Okay, see you later. Bye. Bye. Emma, I remember when you were just a little thing. I used to give you pony back rides. You used to love that. I'd come over for dinner, and your grandma would make the best fried chicken. Stop it! Emma, your grandfather left this for you. I know this is a lot for you to take in right now, but I also know that you are smart and independent, just like your grandfather. And together, we... We? Zebra Stone, we. First my parents died when I'm a baby, then Grandma, and now Papa? He said he would never leave me. He promised, he promised. I hate you. I hate you all. Leave me alone. Emma. That went well. Or your grandma. Sometimes I hear her talking to me just as plain as you and I are talking right now. I don't know if I can do this anymore, but I want to be with her, but I need to take care of you. Papa, don't talk like that. I don't know what I'd do without you. Promise me you will never leave me. Emma. Promise me. I promise. 
That must be your friends. Let them in and I'll go check dinner. be so formal. You and Danny are like family. Call me Papa. But that would be disrespectful. Call him Papa. I told you that. Okay, Papa. See, that wasn't that hard, was it? Girls, never understand them. Hey, Walt. Hello, Stephen. Hi, Anna. Hi. Hello, Sarah. Hello, Sarah. Sure. Hey, how you doing? Sure. How's your dad doing, Daniel? Fine. I guess. No, wait, let's see. Lost his job. Yeah. Mom left. Yeah. Like does is sit in a chair all day drinking. I can't about anything. Including me. Dan, that's not true. Your father loves you very much. It's just he's going some, through some really tough times right now. But things will get better. Better? Better? What about me? The hard times I'm going through. This is Danny. They'll never understand. What it's like. Coming home to that every day. Without you and Emma. Hey, Don't. it's okay. We will always be here for you. Thanks forever. Now, come on in. Let's eat. Hey, Walt, could you uh, meet me in the kitchen? Sure, Steve. Okay. Come on, oh my God, Stephen. Okay. I'm okay, kids. Go ahead and go back and get washed up for dinner. You're yeah, sure I'm, you're okay? I'm fine. Should I call the doctor? No, I'm fine. I'm really, it's okay. It's just, uh, you sure you're okay? Yeah, there's something I need to get you. You need to get this. You need to take this. Just listen. Let's take it to your car. And if anything ever happens to me, give it to Emma. Okay. Steven. No, go now. Before the kids come back. Okay? Please. Okay. This is a math that leads you on a journey to a box. It is up to you what you do with it. Be safe, love, Papa. If I'm gonna do this, then I need help. And I know that just the two people that can help me. I just started. My mom owns the place. That's right. She says I need to be more responsible, whatever that means. You want a soda? Oh, well, just one for me. The map leads us on a journey to a boss that is hidden in the 
buried or something. What do you mean by us? Well, you don't think I'm going to do this on my own, do you? Yes, if I get caught sneaking out of the house, my parents will kill me. Dad doesn't know I'm gone. Papa doesn't even care anyway. Come on, guys, I need your help, please. I'm gonna regret this and probably get grounded for life, but okay, I'm in. <sighs> okay, okay, I'm in too. Uh, so what now? Well, first, I have to go back home and get some of my stuff and go to Sheriff Johnson. I had to stay there now. Saturday morning, meet me at Papa's and bring your backpacks. Why? So we can fill them up with stats of water. Maybe a little trip. Meet me at Papa's at 9 o'clock sharp. Okay. Well, Papa, I guess this is it. Sir and Danny go with me to find the boss. I just hope it's worth it. I don't know if I can do this, Papa. Why did you leave me alone? I just got some dust in my eyes. So now what? Where do we go? We follow the map. We best be going now. Emma, you look like you just saw a ghost. I know this house. This is my parents' house that they used to live. Don't you think it's strange that that map brought us to your parents' house? Why would you need a map to get to your parents' house? Why be so mysterious? Will you stop it? It's not funny. Come on, let's go. What? Anyone have a shovel? Great. Do I have to think of everything? Danny, go look at that tool shed for something to dig. Danny, do this. Danny, do that. What's wrong, Emma? Why are you stopping? Don't you want to know what's in the box? 
Yeah, but it all seemed really strange. Why would my parents bury a box and make him have to find it? Just open it. We didn't come all this way for nothing. What's this? It's my parents when they were young. <laughs> Your parents bought a bunch of stocks and pair computers. According to this, you're rich. Emma, you might want to look at these. No, this can't be right. These are letters from my parents to me, reading these a few years ago. What? Papa lied to me. All the time they were alive and he lied to me? I'm so sorry. So, what are you going to do? Wait, <laughs> wait. Don't you think all this is just a little strange? I mean, come on. First, her parents give her to her grandparents, telling them that they're dead at a young age. Second, Put letters in a box and bury it. This is all a little strange. Why would your parents bury a box and make a map to find it? What does it all mean? I don't know, but I'm sure we're gonna find out.